pretty happy with it. It's my... Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So, as you can tell by the title... Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. If you're not and you already subscribed, hey girl, hey. It's been a while since I've actually done anything to my hair. I'm pretty sure you guys noticed that I haven't really been uploading any hair videos or anything like that. I just had a baby and I've just been being a mom. As you can tell by my roots, it's been a minute. So I always get this question on highlighting my hair and I don't really do anything special. Like I always tell you guys, I'm not a professional. This is like the perfect opportunity because I have a lot of you know black roots so the products that I'm going to be using are the Clairol Professional Pure White Developer and I got this in a volume 20 I always use 20 then of course I have my Wella lighteners I don't think I've ever had to like dye this much new growth then I'm going to do a protein treatment afterwards oh and I'm going to be using TGIN's um, hair care line I haven't lightened my roots in a year so this is a year's worth of like black roots I also got this it's just a mixing bowl and a brush and I'm going to section Woo! you can tell my hair has not been done in a while jeez new mommy who this My hair is not washed so I'm not doing this on clean hair or whatever. Make sure you guys have gloves on because you do not want the bleach to get on your fingers. Not fun. I've been debating on whether I'm going to bite in my edges too because I don't normally do that. I usually leave like a little bit of, you know, like a little bit of black at the roots. But I kind of want to go full on, just like lighten everything. Yeah, I'm nervous. I'm nervous. Okay, so I just mixed one packet for now. I feel like I'm going to need a lot more, but. Okay. <laughs> I know where to start. Where do I start? I'm going to try to work quick because I don't want to be doing this all night there's so much anyways Okay guys, so this is what this section is looking like so far. Kind of left the roots a little bit because I always do that last. So I'm going to let this sit for about 30 minutes and then I'm going to wash it out and I'll be back. So this is what it looks like. There are some parts in between the pink and the now orange that are still kind of dark brown blackish. What I usually do to fix that is I go ahead and I like add, you know, lightener to the little black section. You guys will see when I do it, hopefully I'm explaining it right. All this is done. And so I'm gonna use this Miracle Repair Hydrating Hair Mask that I always condition my hair after a chemical process 
because your hair is going to need that added moisture. I'm gonna go ahead and deep condition it because you gotta do what you gotta do. I like the way this conditioner feels in my hair. You do not need to use like a whole lot of it. Oh yes, it has been a minute. I'm ready to look cute again, okay? I can legit big chop. I'm gonna show you guys what I do. I don't think I'm gonna have to do it with this side because I got pretty close. So right here, I see like the dark hair and I'll just add a little lightener there, rub it in, rub it in. And I'll just do that until I get every single one that I see. So I'm gonna go in the bathroom and I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna let this sit for 30 minutes again. And so this is what everything is looking like. This is not the final color. I am going to lighten it one more time. All right, so I'm gonna add this conditioner. I'm gonna let it sit in for about an hour or two hours. Now it's time for the final process. Hopefully everything turns out the way I want it to be. I just had it like um, deep conditioning and I think, I think I'm not going to rinse the conditioner out of my hair. And this time I'm going to split it into two. After I shampooed it, I made sure that I deep conditioned my hair, wrapped it up and went to sleep. This is what my hair is looking like. All I have is like a little bit of leave-in in it. So yeah. <laughs> so now I have blonde roots and pink ends, which is okay. I'm pretty happy with it. So it looks like I have no edges because I actually added the bleach to my baby hairs and my and my edges so they're really 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 light and blonde but when i do dye my hair whatever color i'm dyeing it you'll see them again like you know they'll reappear i don't know if you guys want me to get closer yeah that's what that's what that looks like that's what the middle looks like all right you guys so if you enjoyed this video make sure you guys leave a thumbs up if you have any questions leave them in the comment section below make sure you guys are subscribed to my channel because i have a lot more videos coming also i'm not leaving my hair like this so if you guys want to know how i revive my hair after doing all of these processes lightening and bleaching it and all that stay tuned for the next video because i will be showing you guys what i do thank you guys for watching this video and i will see you guys on the next one